Hey guys and welcome to Petroped. Welcome to a very, very special, very little video. So last night at the driver's ball, I happened to be sat on the same table as Rubens Barrichello, as you do. And when I asked what he was driving, he said, I'm driving my Braun GP car from 2009. Super cool. But his son, Eduardo, was with him. And I said, what are you driving? And he said, I'm not. I wish. So I got in touch with my amazing friends at Alfa Romeo and Jeep and said, have you got a drive for him? And they went, yeah, we have. So we've sorted him out a drive in a Jeep Trackhawk um, to drive up the hill. So hopefully he'll be here very, very soon. And then we'll get him in the car. He's running a little bit late. It's raining, but this should be just a little bit of fun. Here he comes, <laughs> just in time mate. How are you? I'm good man, I'm good. So guys, this is Eduardo Barrichello. Hello. Or Barrichello, Barrichello, whatever. Sort of whatever. <laughs> whatever you Your car is there mate, get in it and drive it and enjoy. <laughs> Gonna Left hand drive. Oh thank god. <laughs> A big car. Oh, <laughs> Hello. How you doing? How are you? I'm good man. Come in. Let me get you a helmet, eh? Good job, so you've got... Nice to meet you, Eduardo. Yeah, get some pictures, man. <laughs> so how are you feeling, dude? I am, I am kind of nervous because I don't know what to expect. I just, just want to go out. <laughs> just enjoy it, man. Yeah. At least you got four-wheel drive. Yes, that's good. <laughs> So we've managed to get him in the car. He's getting his kind of briefing from uh, the driver. So he will be driving. He's got a pro next to him in the passenger seat. But he's super, super excited. When I spoke to him at the ball last night, he was wanting to learn the track. Uh, he races anyway, um, but it's such a brilliant thing to be able to give him this experience. I'm going to see if I can get a quick word with him before he goes up. He's back. <laughs> Compulsory photo shoot. Now oh, that is a that is a happy smile. So narrow. Huh? So narrow. Yeah, yeah, it's mega narrow, isn't it? And you imagine how the guys go up so fast. This is, this is fast on the straight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Told you. I, I couldn't push much because I didn't know the track, yeah. especially because it's wet, not my car. <laughs> so I just didn't want to do something wrong, but it was nice. Good? It was nice. Up oh, there, so many cars. Yeah. Like, so <laughs> expensive stuff. Yeah, yeah. So, mate, how was that? That was great. Go up. I did not know what to expect actually because it's raining, I didn't know the car, yeah. I didn't know the track. But um, you still enjoyed it. Though, right? It was good. I How would've... fast is that car, though? It's really fast for, a, it's for an really SUV. Fast. It's like it's what really on earth? Really, really <laughs> so we are now off to the start line because your dad's driving the Brawn up the hill. Yes. When that's in the cool. rain. In the rain. Uh, which would you rather drive, that or the Brawn in the rain? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I guess the Brawn. <laughs> <laughs> Well, oh, mate, that is so cool. Yeah, so was, cool that you enjoyed it. So I reckon we'll follow you down and we'll go and uh, say hello to your dad. Yeah, that's cool. a great idea. Next stop, start line. I think we go this way. <laughs> so we're walking down to the car and uh, there it is, the brawn car, and here he is, man. Where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Here's my main man Rubens now. Uh, apparently it's very narrow. <laughs> but he still wants to drive your car up the hill today. <laughs> now he's had a practice. Now that, now that, did you enjoy going up? Yes. Yes. Nice. Okay. I told, I told him, please, 
just look after it. It's so wet. <laughs> and uh, I was so scared because I wasn't there. I couldn't, you know, I had to take the car down. But I wouldn't we have We bought tissues time. and everything. Yeah. There were tissues for you crying oh, in the car. I know. And, you know. <laughs> that would have happened. I know. I know for sure. He but did anyway, really well. It was, yeah. was, it, was it okay? Yeah, I mean, yeah, it was good. I'm was sure good he nice. took care of it. So. Yeah. It's still shiny side up. Yeah. And that's a good thing. Good man. So you're about to drive up the hill in your brawn. Yeah. In the rain. <laughs> Which brings me great memories. Um, Ross is here today. Yeah. Uh, the whole the whole crew is is here. So yeah. I'm really excited. And so it must uh, be amazing for you to get back is. in that car. Right? I just uh, I went uh, round and round and did my did some some of the donuts here. Oh, we're just about to get, get run over by your car. Swapping plugs. <laughs> going in front of the. Well, and this what? Okay. Cool. Well, um, I uh, I'll uh, leave it there. But good luck at the run. I'll see. I'll see you after the run. Definitely, mate. Thank you. Absolute Thank pleasure, you so Eduardo. You Thank are you. a superstar, man. Thank you very much. Brilliant. Right. So we're gonna get some uh, footage of uh, Rubens banging up the hill in the brawn. Matt. Still my favourite Formula One car. That 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 season with Jensen and Rubens was just wicked. Well, this certainly has been a festival of speed for meeting your heroes. Look at that. that. For me, the story of Braun, the year that they won the World Championship in this car, is still one of the greatest Formula One stories of all time. You know, from a team that was on its knees uh, and, and wasn't racing, they lost their engine and then they basically strapped the Mercedes engine into the back of what was a Honda chassis and went out and absolutely smashed it. Uh, and with Rubens and Jensen, just brilliant. So it's great. I'm going to stay here and kind of try and get some footage of Rubens going up the hill. But I'm just so chuffed that with uh, the help of Jeep and, and the guys at FCA, we managed to make Eduardo's day. <laughs> it's a shame they don't still make a noise like that. That's the noise. <laughs> oh man. Uh, Valtteri, it's raining. Yeah. Slippy. Gonna give us a bit of uh, donuts and wheel action, or is it just about get in the car back in one piece? Uh, I think rain can sometimes make it more fun, so yeah, it should, yeah. be, should be good. Um, unfortunately, no smoke from the tyres. No, but, no. But try to do maybe some donuts, burnouts, and maybe go fast or get some spray. Yeah, you just had someone come up and give you some valuable tips for the uh, for the season. Yeah, someone just told me to go a bit quicker in the next race. So really? I said, okay, I'll try. That's so, a good plan. Yeah. Good plan. Yeah, <laughs> well, best of luck today. Yeah. Good luck for the rest of the season. Thank you. Brilliant. Yeah. Always good to have a bit of a chat with uh, current F1 driver Valtteri Bottas who's driving this actually let me just spin you around so fantastic so the beauty of having a media pass and getting onto the grid is you can get up close and personal with all of these cars um, unfortunately I uh, filmed that much footage this week that this camera's just decided to fill its memory card which is really really annoying so I'm now on my iPhone but we will make do I'm sure it'll be fine Life's good. Yeah, Happy. The snow cars are nice. Yeah. yeah the... you, you're living in uh, Sao Paulo. Uh, okay. How old are you? I'm seven. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oops, there's the I, I, <laughs> I took a picture with you last year in Austin. Uh, right, yes. Okay. I was, I was oh, here for yes. I remember you came up. Yeah. I do. Okay. You introduced yourself. Yes. Uh, nice. Thanks for that. No worries. Yeah, I know. I know. Good thing.
vai de boa, tá? I'm going to draw that video to a close and I had to have the Alfa Romeo racing F1 car driven by Antonio Giovinazzi. Antonio Giovinazzi driving. That kind of turned into a bit of an F1 special but yeah what a what a brilliant brilliant thing to be able to kind of get to meet Rubens and Eduardo Barrichello and help him have his first drive up the Goodwood Festival of Speed Hill Climb. I have a feeling it's not going to be his last, but I hope you enjoyed that one, guys. If you did so, please give me a thumbs up. Comments below are always welcome, and if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to Petrol Fed for plenty more content to come, and I will see you on the next film, guys, but you take care. Drive safe.